Hi, my name is Alexander Zanfir. Welcome to Introduction to Game Development with Unity. I would like to start by showing the finished product. This is what you will make completely from scratch in just a few hours. Code, game design, 3D assets, and animation. Now that's rapid production. Our focus will be rapid production, without any sacrifice to quality. We will cover everything that you need to produce this game or a game like this, including how to acquire the free assets used in this game template from the Unity Asset Store. We will also use the Unity Animation tools to create the animations you see here from start to finish. We will use an adapted design style where we only implement as much code and architecture as needed to make the current feature work without over committing to a design for future features. This balance between design for the now and for the future is almost an art. Understanding the design principles in both game development and in general programming are what make it happen. And so you will learn the design principles that work with Unity, from using .NET interfaces and events to separate concerns to sequentially componentizing each game feature. We will allow bugs to occur because, as we learn, they might not be bugs at all, and we will work through bugs together. We will see how they arise and we will solve them. I will initially teach through theory and then through example in the later modules. Now let's cover what we'll be going over in the next seven modules. In the first module, we'll look at the fundamentals of Unity. And then in the second, we will dive right into creating the environment for our game template. Next, we will start laying out the fundamental components of our game in module three and four. At this point, we'll have a game by definition with a full game cycle losing condition, and different waves of enemies. Next, we will add the GUI overlays and create a health bar, as well as GUI elements for other useful information the player needs to know. At this point, we will add some extra features, such as new weapons, the ability to pick up and drop or swap weapons and items. We will finish up the course by publishing the game to the web, so your friends can try it out and enjoy it. Overall, this course will produce a game template you can use to make a desktop or web game. And although this course does not cover mobile development, the concepts you learn in this course can be used in a mobile Unity game. As well as the game templates can be converted over to a mobile game with some extra steps 